You are now between 13 and 14 weeks pregnant. Your baby is now 7.5 inches long and weighs 30 grams. Now all the bodies are laid out, sticking your baby its energy into growing. The amount of amniotic fluid is constantly increasing. This amniotic fluid is vital for a fetus, it ensures that he can move and it also works as a pad. You fall once, then your stomach, or repelling accidentally notice your baby clean. In addition, the amniotic fluid for a constant heat, making your baby in the womb never gets cold. He further takes you every now and then a sip of amniotic fluid and he learns so swallow and drinks. Now he pees in the amniotic fluid. The amniotic fluid is refreshed throughout the day, making the waste ever be drained. Because your baby only going to grow, you can get a tummy. Maybe you got your pants already no longer close, but that had to do with the hormones and the fact that your intestines can arise. From now on it will grow your belly really come through the growth of the baby. The obstetrician or gynecologist can now also externally check if the baby grows well. She does through her hands to your belly and so to calculate how large the distance between the top of the uterus and your pubic bone is. To that distance can be seen or the size of your baby according to the gestational age. Have you got any belly or not yet a grams arrived? That's not to say that your child does not grow well. If you arrive a lot, does that mean that your child is growing hard? All babies grow the same to 16 weeks. Only then created individual differences. As long as the obstetrician says that everything is going well, you don't have to worry. From a legal point of view, you have your pregnancy at least three weeks before your maternity leave starts. Report it to your employer. It's not convenient to have to wait that long. Tell your employer therefore as you're ready. In this way, all practical matters will be arranged, such as replacement and leave. In addition, it is good to know if you can be honest with your employer if you're tired or feel lousy. Your employer will order a statement of your midwife or your gynecologist pregnancy questions that the due date is. This date is needed for the application of your leave. Under the influence of the pregnancy hormones are the sebaceous glands in your skin a lot more active. You have normally dry skin, then you have probably benefit, your skin will be smoother and more radiant. Is your house naturally already quite fat? then you have chance that now even fatter, causing pimples can occur. You keep your skin healthy by drinking lots of water and eat fruits and vegetables. Your hair also changes during pregnancy. The female hormone estrogen causes much less than normal and so is fuller than ever. Unfortunately it is but of short duration. After your pregnancy increases the amount of estrogen in your body off again, making you lose all those detained hair again. Voice your facial cream and your shampoo on your skin and your hair during pregnancy.